It's a lot of things that I want my children to be able to walk away with in any engagement. I want their confidence boosted. I want their desire for information quenched. I want their insight expanded. That doesn't happen every single time. As if I know that I may have seemed judgmental or that's how it was perceived, then I give myself that break and then I'm just honest with her. I'm like, I know that this is what it sounded like, but let me explain what I meant or let me clarify why or where it came from. You're not gonna have all the answers, so it's kind of foolish to pretend that you will. And I think being able to be vulnerable and to admit when you're wrong and to admit when you don't have the answers is, is really powerful. It goes a long way. I found that I don't always have the right answers. So I try to make a habit of keeping things open to the possibility of we can discuss this later. Instead of a nail, I'll put a pin in it. Choose a different day, a different scenario to have that same conversation. Every day is a new day, so you can have that conversation again just the next day. Don't keep pressuring, pushing a conversation when they've already shut down. I definitely have learned when to pull back on things with, with my kids. Um, and once you can figure that out, then I think everything goes a lot smoother. I plan to, you know, lean on my partner. Um, she's wonderful, and you know, I think one trick you learn in education and in parenting is the switch. My thought with the worst case scenario would be to kind of tag out uh, and see how it goes, you know, with me out of that situation and mom taking over. I don't know if I'll ever know if I got it right. <laughs> um, I, I, um, I don't think. Um, as a parent, we truly know. Um, I think that um, I try to make the best out of those conversations, and um, I guess I wait to hear feedback from them. The best thing that uh, someone taught me very early on was to not beat yourself up if you make a mistake, because you're going to. It's inevitable. That was, especially in the you know, in early in her life, that small piece of advice really saved me.